Welcome back to another Truck Tim video. You find me in a field that's mapped out like an off-road course. There's a big like jump just there. And we've got the uh, S series here. <laughs> well, this has got front air and rear air. Look, watch this. Do you need a ladder? Very bumpy. No, it's quite smooth. Let's go. Oh, maybe I lied. Oh. <laughs> Jeez. <gasps> what was that? We do like a bit of off-roading these days. <laughs> Actually, off-roads quite well, to be honest. Will she do a donut? Uh, not very well. I think I was just going around in circles. We're doing another raffle. We're gonna do this, aren't we, Ian? We sure are. We have the box here. You're gonna get to work, aren't you? There's a link in the description of this video where you can buy your tickets. Best of luck. Let's get to work. Let's get to work. Yeah, then, take that. Why are you burying the FH? Because I can't do it anymore. Can't get around this Ooh. shop anymore. Who are these lads? These are two of my sons. Oh, I thought you were gonna say you picked them up off the street to come and help. No, because that would be the truth we've mentioned it several times in the videos lately we're running out of space as you can see well, you can't work here. here you've got this bit here and you come around here it's not happening is it let's go we have a new unit we do and it's a little bit bigger than this just a little bit not much i think we'll get one more truck in the new one just just one, one, more. one more truck yeah one hour helpers are getting stuff down from the top we're going to go over and have a look at the new unit and pick up some potato boxes from where the new unit is to bring back here and load all of this stuff into them Can't for wait. the move for the big move the big move we're moving from the original trucker tim hq it's a bit emotional actually i've been here over a year moving in this view will be no longer. I think there's probably a few people around on the estate that's glad we're going, because we were quite noisy. And it's got quite busy. It has got very busy. When I moved in down here, there was only like two occupied, but where we're going, we don't need to worry about that. No, no, no. God. I don't know what's going on up there. No. See, now we know how our neighbors felt. No kitchen at the new place, Ben. And no office. Are you happy? No. So that's an is issue. All right, come on then. Let's go and show the viewers the new unit. We've got to go and get the S series and the trailer first. Where are we going? The tea break, apparently. Tea break? Yeah. I ain't done any work. <laughs> oh, I need to clean these stairs. Man, I'm not going to get my deposit back. There's no place to work. The end. Marks the end of this HQ. Another chapter complete, then. Another chapter complete. Let's go to the next chapter. You're excited, aren't you? I'm excited. Yeah. New beginnings for the Trucker Tim channel. I'm excited to show the avid followers of the Trucker Tim channel the new unit. I just want to get moved in now, Ben. They have to have all of the trucks in one place. I think you might... Why is this road so busy? You might be upsetting the locals. Sorry, though. already? Yeah. <laughs> look cute. Oh, look at, look at, look at the, the, look at the workshop over look there. Look at the like. workshop. Ooh, we can see her. Oh, here we go, upset oh, the locals. Already. Trucker Tim. <laughs> oh. Morning. What's that, Trucker Tim? There she is. I'm going to extend the trailer as well, Ben. I'm going to extend it for potato boxes. We're here. This is the door. This is the door. To the new unit. This is going to be all tidied up. Show them the, the foliage. Yeah. This will be a nice little area here. Garden and stuff. 
<laughs> Shall we go in? Let's go. Show the viewers the new Trucker Tim HQ. It's only a little bit bigger. Will this do you, Benny boy? She will do. Oh. Watch your head. Four and a half meters for trucks. Come on in, Benny boy. Will this do us for space? Look at the size of that. I'm going to do a gentle job. Just trying to give people an idea of the size. The sheer scale. Still, still going. And there. <laughs> so we have a front door and a back door, basically like a drive-through. You know there. we had trouble at the old unit with fumes, shall we say, from the old uh, FHV8. <laughs> we now have extractor system. So that sucks the air in and then blows it out that end so we can keep ventilating. We'll definitely get all my trucks in here, won't I? Definitely. So each section, each section could be a truck. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Welding, fabrication base. Fabrication you say? Fabrication I say. Ooh. Press. Yeah, press break? You're pushing your luck, you are. Plasma table. Plasma table? When Ben needs to plug his welder in, the climb up there to plug it in. The other side of this shed, there is three phase sockets. They're gonna, getting popped through. They're getting popped through. I'm gonna poke them through. In the middle of each the one of these. <laughs> Trucks on display. You could get more than, you know, the truck you park in here for show purposes, like the R series and the S series when it's done, can be put next to one another, can't they? So it opens up more space. Get two per bay, if there was tight. Two, four, six, eight, ten. You could get 12 trucks potentially along there. Tight, yeah. For working, ten, easy. For working on purposes. Yes. One truck per bay. Yeah. And I'd like to leave an empty bay, you know, so if anyone wants to. An empty bay? Bring God. something in. Bring something in. They can bring it in. I think I'm in here. Staircase up there. Ooh, ben. To an office with a balcony on the side of it. Balcony over top of you welding. So you can see that there. Yeah. And then you can have a, a little um, picnic area. <laughs> <laughs> picnic area. I'm coming. Take time. Give me a note now, innit? Where's the 13 mil spanner? Oh. <laughs> With the other unit, I got that, and it was like, whoa, that's massive. Mm -hmm. Within a year, I filled it up, and it's no longer massive. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let us know in the comments if you like the new unit, if you like this video as well. There's a, there's a lot to do though, isn't there, Ben? Hell of a lot. There's a lot to do. Big move. I think we need to try and put the truck in. I don't think it's going to go. You're not sure that height, are you? I'm not. I think you can have my trumpets off. Come on! Loads of room! <laughs> you, you could fit your... Our series behind and the FHV8 behind that, I reckon. How much room was there? I'll have to look back on Half the video. Half a metre. Half a metre. She's in with these. And the trailer. I reckon if the grain weren't there, you could near enough come in and screw around in there and drive back out the other door. Yeah, I'll bet. Look at that. Well, that's just put a bit of perspective. That has, yeah. That's made your truck look very small. <laughs> Mental. We need to make use of space. the space above as well, somehow, I think. Because yeah. there's a lot. You've got the space again there, haven't you, near, near enough? 
We need some lifts like Sean's got so we can lift the truck up in the air. Yes, that's what I want. Tatty boxes for the move. I'm going to try and extend it. Oh my. Not planning on selling this trailer ever, are you? How many stickers, Ben? And then you want to pull in the industrial estate fully extended. Oh, yeah, I do, yeah. Of course you do. Oh! hours later so that wasn't hard was it ben getting them on easy we loaded up with potato boxes 11 tatty boxes wait right, come on ben we've got to go i know you don't want to go now do you why are we walking back in we need to go this is good We're having to drag ourselves away, I can feel it. Yeah, we are. Right, we better go back and see how these lads are getting on. I'm sure they're waiting eagerly for our potato boxes. I'm fairly certain they're probably asleep. If you look over there, you'll see the R series, Ben. There it is. Oh, I see ya. There she is. Left there to rot away. No, not left there to rot. No? She's waiting. Oh, fair. To go to the new home. I have all of my stuff in one place. Can't afford my mortgage now. I've got to tell Helen. Oh. She's always wanted a caravan. I think she wanted to let like, a holiday in caravan. Oh, a leisure caravan. Yeah, that's it. Le leisure van in. Copy. <laughs> Loves it. Don't forget, I'll you've got old stretch train. Yeah, I don't know how she's gonna go down the old estate. Not good. There you go, Look straight up. Whoa! God, I'm a good driver. I can drive. Oh uh, dear. They're ready. <whistles> oh. Moving out has started. <sighs> All good bits, Ben, actually, for a restoration job. Oh, we're doing a restoration again, aren't I we? I think we'll just keep all this stuff in these boxes until it's needed. Four series chassis. Oh, well. four series chassis to go that. in. Yeah. That can come now. Yeah. Get that back in the unit. Forgot about the chassis, all these bits come off. Genuine scan your fold out steps. Needed. Donor truck. Receiving truck. Right, I'm literally going to have to spend the whole day moving trucks. Got this to move, that to move, those two to move are. The S and the four series chassis. Air bottles. Don't lose your bottle, will you? Jesus. Just wire room. The four series. I feel like I should be playing some sad music. Don't ask questions. Get no lies. Come on lads, you're flagging. Whee! I put this up here when I moved in. Oh dear. Well, I was thinking about getting the new... <laughs> I was thinking about getting the new unit deep clean before we moved in. Looking at that, probably not worth Look at the colour of this cobweb. All my number plates. Uh, big pants, big pants I have in this place. Four tiles down here, some lines. All of my memorabilia is going to be coming here. What, what, you, then what you happened? turned up. Come in on your first day and went, missing big enough. Yeah, this has got to go. This has got to go. And look what's happening. Oh, look, very good. I remember putting these up. 
back in the day when can, life was simple. You can put them back up. I mean, when life was simple. Same. That's it. That was that. The sticker stairs are no more. All the stickers have gone. Oh my! Let's take that one, mate. Cheers. Thank you. Be careful that bit, yeah. No, its boards are gone. You've got to get this axle buttoned up. So we can get this out. Yes, that's my next job. All these other bits can be strapped on the bed, can't it? With the engines got to go on there, the cabs, that metal. The fifth wheel can go on the pallet on the truck. We need Ed. Oh! <laughs> ben, look! <laughs> the grill can go on the bed of the trailer. All this can go in the Ranger. Load these pallets up. Ah, load these pallets up. And then stick it straight on. That's her parked up, ready to be moved to the new unit. All oh, the truck parts. Exciting times ahead. So... Got something to show you, dear. Bye. Well, I can guess what it is, but... Look. Yeah. It's come big. With, come with me. Ta-da! Jeez. Oh, it's huge. Do you like oh, it? It's big. Do you like it, Leo? Wow. Trucker Tim HQ Mark II. You need one this big? Yes. Why is it so tall? Because it, it was a potato stores. Where's my office? Ah, office. Yeah, about that. And where's the toilet? Yeah, yeah. Merchandise. You're going to have to do that from the garage at home. Sorry. <laughs> and see, he's having fun. But... <laughs> Happiness. Are you happy? No. So yeah, merchandise, you have to do it from the garage. We'll sort you out, set you up in the garage. And probably not going to be able to afford the mortgage now. What? Because of this. So you've always wanted a caravan, so you might be getting one to live in. We've got lots of power, Helen. We've got three phase electric. Lots of fabrication going on in here, dear. Cool. Storage for my trucks. Proper schmuseum type, isn't it? Stuff. Office for Helen. Oh, no, wait. Oh, that's not happening. Oh, but we have thought we might put an office in. Okay. Eventually. In this corner, probably like here, from there, yeah. down here and to here. That'd be a really big office. Not that big, would it? Yeah, it's much bigger than what we've got now. And then here, we can put some windows in, yeah. or down here, yeah. and look at the view you'd have from the corner. The view you'd have from your office. Look at that. So we're all happy. Until the next video. You find me at my office. We've just Slash had an email. bedroom. Yes, we've just had an email, Helen. Look, come in. Okay. From Norman. Norman understands his very short notice. However, he hopes I'm able to help he needs a fast track moving from just up the road yep. to Fort William. Where's That's Fort William? How far up? Scotland. A good way. Right. And it's currently... 2.15? In the afternoon. And I've got to go and get loaded. He's You're doing it? You're going? I've told him I'm doing it. Right. Norrie's Lorries is from the Outer Hebrides. I'm taking it to Fort William. Then he's meeting me there and he's going to drive the fast track on the ferry to the Outer Hebrides, which is even further out. Right, better pack a bag. Oh, first night out in the S-Series ever as well. Is it? Yeah, I'm taking the S-Series. Norman's seen my TikToks. P.S. Love the TikToks. He's seen my TikToks. Has he seen the YouTube channel? Probably not, but I'm sure he's watching this video. I'm gonna get his fast track on then. Also, if you do have any uh, haulage inquiries, let me know. Truckertimtransport at gmail.com. There is a link in the description to the email. Isn't there, Helen? There is. We need to do a little bit more haulage, don't we? Yes. Lots of things happening. God. Mm. Yes. <laughs> Expensive things. Mm -hmm. So, I'm going trucking. Goodbye, dear. Bye. 
when the door shuts, she's gonna go, yes! Oh my God. Here she is. The good thing is as well, it's just been detailed by DK Detailing. Yes. I am excited for a last minute load. I am literally the last minute Scotland Express. It's been a while. The last time we went up was when we collected my trailer from GBT Sales and we got pulled in at Todd Hills testing station by Voza. This is it. Let's see how this goes down. Maybe he's just a fan. We've got to go past there again on this trip. Let's hope we just sail on by. Let's fill out the defect book. Keep ourselves on the straight and narrow. We need some bedding. We haven't got any bedding in this truck. First night in the truck. Get that in there ready for later. I think we're ready to depart. What we got? 65% diesel, 85% add blue. Add blue will be okay. Diesel, we're gonna have to get some on this trip. Departing the yard at 10.52 in the afternoon, heading for Fort William. Just before we leave, this Volvo here with stacks and everything is going to be going up for raffle on my channel. Around Christmas time, you're going to be able to win this. So make sure you hit the subscribe button, like this video. If you want to see that happen, let us know in the comments as well if you'll be buying a ticket. That could be yours at Christmas time. Let's go to Scotland. Well, Spalding first. Load up the JCB fast track that needs to be fast tracked to a Scotland. So we won't be back here until tomorrow night. Big job on. We need every minute of driving time to get to Fort William tonight. So we're heading across country. We're going from the flats of the Fens to the hills of Scotland. I love this air suspension. This road is so bad, but I'm just floating on air. I've been down here in the R series. The cab need to come off. This will be the first ever fast track I've moved. So I think this is where we're loading here. John Deere. We'll get a JCB drive. Looks like they're unloading a combine header here. We've moved one of them on this trailer before. Took a load of white paint off. Oh, it's only a little thing. Going all the way to Fort William with that. 